Hello everyone, welcome to Success Development. In today's video, we are going to install Advanced Police Job Script into our 5M server. So, without any further ado, let's get to the installation process. So this is the script which you are going to install into a 5M server. This is a free version of High Def Police Job. I'll provide the link in the description below. Now in the releases, click on the latest version. After that, click on source code and download the script. After downloading it, we just need to extract the file. Now open the file, then copy this file from here and paste it into your 5M resource folder. So I will be pasting it over here, just like this. Now we have to delete the default QB Police Job from here. Just like this. Now we have to rename the file and remove these numbers from here. Now open the file, go to images and copy these images from here and paste it into your QB inventory. For that, you just need to go to QB inventory, HTML, images and paste your images over here. Just like this. Now open the readme file. Now we have to scroll down from here and copy this line of code from here and paste it into your items.lua. For that, you just need to go to QB core, shared, items.lua now come to the very bottom line of the code and you have to paste it over here just like this now press ctrl save now open the config.lua from here we can configure police job script in here you can config the blip colors which are in your server so i'll be keeping them default for now and we can easily configure these locations according to our police station's mlo and from here we can configure armory so yes that's it for the installation part now let's start the server so we are in a server now let's get on duty from here you just need to use your target eye click on sign in then click on sign to on duty now with this advanced police job script we get these items in our armory first item is handcuffs as we all know and when you handcuff a person, we have to use cuff keys to uncuff them. But if you're a criminal, then you don't have any access to the cuff keys. But in that case, you can use bolt cutter to break the handcuffs. The another item is zip tie, which is used to do soft cuff. To uncuff someone with the zip tie, we have to use flush cutter. So the last item is Leo GPS. Now let's use it. Now we have to write the name of our call sign. So I'll be writing 101. After that, click on activate GPS. Now let's open the map. As you can see over here, this is our blip of our GPS, as you can see. Now let's spawn a car, so I'll be spawning T20. So as you can see on the map, the blip has been changed to car. Now let's spawn a chopper, so I'll be spawning Paul Mav. Now as you can see in here, our blip has been changed to chopper. Now let's spawn a boat, so I'll be spawning C Sharp. And as you can see on the blip, the blip has been changed to boat. Yes guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos related to 5M development. Goodbye.